footwork is an art. I'm a sample. I do this. The technology so on point now, we can sample pretty much anything now. Gems technicians basically like, you can say like a group of a DJs basically. You know, what we do, we juke the tracks out. You know, Chicago, you know, it's gonna be, it's a town full of talent, but it's also a town full of haters. Because that's what it is, it's a battle. better dancers that get molded by the better dancers in the group. Then the other group, Legends, Wolfpack, they mold Terror Squad, then Terror Squad mold the leaders, and then, you know what I'm saying, it's from so on and so on and so on. You know, it's called basics like uh, dribbles, skates, um, bangs, it's like original moves that, that the people who started for work before us was doing, and it just dabble down and then you create, you know, you create something with it. We didn't land on footwork. Footwork landed on us. You know what sounds that inspire me? Yeah. All sounds. It's all sounds. All sounds. Because the, the ear is a part of who we are. A lot of people don't understand you need your ears. It's no limitation to your ears. It's no limitation to your sight. A lot of these people out here, they claim in Chicago we got rap views, but they don't they really don't want to hear it because Chicago's roots is dance. I used to be a dancer and a lot of the dancers that was in the group would be a house sabbatic. They was more of footworkers, but we never knew in the years to come that it would become a style of music to help them out. But as much as I was on the turntables, a lot of people that was juke just stopped and just looked at us doing the footwork and they just learned to say, well, hey, instead of standing in one spot dance with these girls, I like to move with their feet and the rest was history. My part in footwork is to bring the soul back, bring that soul where it's like, Anybody can make a track and then just do, 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 do but bring some soul to it, you know what I'm saying? You know, use it, you know, you know, do it from here, you know what I'm saying? And that goes with any music. Like I said before, I look, I look for the sounds that that's not being used or, you know what I'm saying? If it's old, if I got, if I got to take that sound and chop it up, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm going to do. I'm, I just want to make it different or it might be one of my favorite records that I listen to like, like this. I call this the robot, uh, of course, it's uh, um, craft work. So I want to make it future. I want that to sound futuristic and no, not just thin footwork. The sounds, you know, just make it a little bit different, you know what I'm saying? And like I said, something futuristic and something soulful. Or something, some jazz, and I'm a big jazz fanatic. Um, just something that, like I said before, is, where's the soul? That like, bring the soul back. Anybody can make a footwork track. Anybody can sit up here and jump on these fruit loops and make a track. There's nothing against fruit loops, you know what I'm saying? It's just what you're doing with it. Bring the soul out. <laughs> My samples basically is telling the story, so I guess that was another thing that I did. Learned how to tell a story within my music. What kind of stories are you interested in? What, what? Oh, any, anything, anything. But, but I, I, I like basically saying Turner, the, the footwork himself, him or her, into the music. Basically, listen to what I say. It could be some something frightening, some scary, some spooky. Basically, anything that will put you in battle mode. A battle that's basically non-stop, but it's about the individual who takes control of themselves with the music. That's all it's about.